welcome to the Cycling Celebration channel, where we feature videos that highlight the cycling lifestyle. I'm James Few back with another video for cycling enthusiasts of all ages. In all my recent videos I'm riding with my boo, Rosalind. In this video I rode on the Azub Thai Fly X there's a story behind every video and this one is going to be about all my collection of bikes, recumbent trikes and the cat trike monster quad. These videos are not showing each intersection from all angles and it may appear that I'm boldly running through stop signs. I don't want anyone to get the wrong idea. My hands are positioned over the brake levers as we approach an intersection. At the same time I'm looking both directions for any traffic. When it comes to safety experience as an important component, knowing what time and what day you're riding makes a difference in how you should approach an intersection. The first trike I purchased in 2010 from Paul's Bike Depot on Gratiot Avenue. That was a Sun CXT3, an entry-level trike with three 20-inch wheels. This trike was $1,400 and I got a loan from my credit union to make this investment. The trike world was brand new to me and I had no idea what to expect. I found this first trike to be durable and reliable, especially for the price. If you're used to riding on a road bike then you will be pleasantly surprised by how comfortable it is. Generally recumbent trikes are not as fast as a road bike. The Sun CXT3 is moderately fast for a trike. As my interests grew, I discovered many trike models and manufacturers. One of such was Utah Trikes in Payson, Utah. They carry many brands and do custom modifications that are unique in the industry. Also they have finance plans through Synchrony Bank with zero interest for 18 months. It all depends on what you want and what your budget is. In some cases it's like buying a car in 18 months. The recumbent lifestyle is certainly an investment like purchasing a motorcycle or a boat. I would recommend getting the first trike as a used one in good condition. In 2013 I purchased my next trike from Utah Trikes. It was a Cat Trike Annihilator which is a modified Cat Trike Villager that has 24-inch front tires and a 26-inch rear wheel. This is a comfortable trike with a somewhat higher seat position and a headrest. I believe this purchase was around $3,200 including shipping costs. That was more than I ever thought I would spend on what is essentially a three-wheel bike. After riding this trike for 18 months I was hooked on the recumbent cycling lifestyle. By this time I had accessorized my riding with Bluetooth speakers and a GoPro camera. Next in line was the Cat Trike Dumont which is a full suspension folding trike with a 26-inch rear wheel. I also introduced myself to my first internally geared hub. This trike was $2,000 more than the Annihilator at $5,200 including shipping costs. By now it was early 2016 and 18 months later I would buy my first quad cycle from Utah Trikes in March of 2018. Sometime before that I decided to make room in the garage by selling my Sun CXT3. The Cat Trike Monster Quad was another Cat Trike Villager modification with a rear axle and differential. This purchase came in at around $8,000. Yes, I said 8 grand. The difference here was the 1000 watt Bafong electric motor and 248 volt batteries. The Cat Trike Monster Quad came with a large carrying rack sitting on top of the rear axle. I had some much fun experimenting with high-powered Bluetooth speakers mounted on the rear carrying rack. Because of its size and weight the Monster Quad has its limitations. But up till this point it was the fastest riding I had ever experienced. When I was in my 30s I had a fast lightweight 10-speed road bike. Man that thing was fast. Definitely could pedal up to maybe 30 miles per hour. Electric motors have changed the game for cycling enthusiasts. So in 2019 I walked into American Cycle and Fitness, the Trek bicycle store to test ride a Trek Powerfly e-bike. That was as fast or faster than the Monster Quad and the pedal assistance doesn't cut out till you reach 28 miles per hour. I had to have one of these bikes. And this would be my first all-cash purchase of such magnitude. By the time they cashed me out I had spent around $4,800. You would think I'd be done after spending so much money on bikes. I watch a lot of videos and YouTube of people riding recumbent trikes. One that got my attention was a trike made by a Zub called the Tie Fly X. The Tie Fly X is a full suspension folding trike with 26 inch wheels and hydraulic disc brakes. So in the video, it appears they're moving along at a decent rate of speed. Up until 2019 all I had was the Cat Trike brand far as recumbent trikes go. Early 2019 I financed the Azub Thai Fly X from Utah Trikes. All of the videos showing the Thai Fly X zipping around were exaggerated. The Thai Fly X is a tank of a trike. Maybe I did get a little used to the pedal assistance with the electric motors on the Cat Trike Annihilator and the Cat Trike Monster Quad. 
Yes, I may have fallen off a bit over the last couple of years but I'm still riding until the wheels fall off. The TIE Fly X is a very expensive trike with a base price around $7,000 and with the addition of a roll-off hub the final price came in at around $9,500 including shipping costs. If your intentions are to get in shape or stay in shape I wouldn't recommend a trike or bike with a motor. If you need help keeping up or traveling longer distances I recommend getting a system with pedal assist only, no throttle, that makes riding too easy. There probably are many brands and models of trikes I'd like to own but one stood out among the others, the Triad trike. This trike is designed with full suspension, a CX performance line mid-drive electric motor, a continuously variable transmission rear wheel hub and hydraulic disc brakes. It is pedal assist only and capable of going 28 miles per hour before the motor drops out. The Triad was an all-cash purchase I received one year ago. I've stayed up all night once again working on another video so if you find anything interesting or entertaining please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.